The Salvation Army wrapped up its week-long anniversary celebration for the Croc Center with Angel Day. Leslie Rojas brings us along. Basketball courts, aquatic, and performing arts centers. For 12 years, the Croc Center has been a staple amongst the Biloxi community. Today, being Angel Day, we invited everyone from the community to come free of charge and experience the facility, especially those people who were recipients of our angel tree back last December. We mailed every child an invitation to come and enjoy the Croc Center for free. The center was founded by Joan Croc. Years ago, she was visiting Biloxi and was moved by what she saw when she drove through a neighborhood on Division and Lee Street. From that point, Major Jerry Friday says she made it a mission to create a facility to help give back. So this location was handpicked by Joan Crock herself, and she right away gave the Salvation Army of Biloxi a um, million dollars. The Crock is free for low income people. Each year, several scholarships are awarded to people who won't otherwise be able to afford to use the center. I feel like it brings the community together. It gives an opportunity for the kids to just have fun, have a good time, and it's free. It's beautiful. I love it, you know, and I'm grateful for it, absolutely. For Ian Newton and Rain Seeger, this is the first time they visited the center. But after using the amenities, they say it won't be the last. Oh, it's pretty, it's pretty nice. I like how you have like gyms, volleyball, pool, pretty much everything. Friday says the center will always be a place for everyone, regardless of age and socioeconomic background. In Biloxi, Leslie Rojas, WLOX News Now. Applications for the Salvation Army's Angel Tree program are opening up in October. Of course, WLOX will share all the details on how to apply when the time comes, so stay tuned.